Okay, let's see here. 23-616 USA versus Sharma. S-H-A-R-M-A. Uh, that is a case uh, that's being heard in the U.S. Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. And it deals specifically with artificial intelligence, vampiric sexual energy torture chamber programs with artificial intelligence, directly tied to a conversation that I had with 13th Arcturian White Bear Clan mother, Karen Ann Luke McDonald, when she asked me a question one time. And, um, and then, of course, how that's directly tied to the documents that she presented at the International Criminal Court. But more importantly, um, I, I'm, I'm, because I'm neutral, in, in many ways, when I become aware of what I become aware of, I have to decide whether I'm even going to bother sharing it with anybody, particularly in a public way on, on this phone, right? Because of why I know that we're all here. And so ever since I was a four-year-old little child, I'm processing what's going on around me because I experience pure, internal, eternal, absolute love in my heart. So I'm moving at a very high rate of speed, naturally. So the security protocols are as tight as tight can be as a result of that when you put it through what I call the permanent records of why we're all here and how that relates to access, access to files, access to the permanent records, okay, as a reason why we're all here. And, and those of us that have, if you will, agreements, right, and um, contracts, right, of uh, 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 missions, very specific missions, right, um, that um, I, I'm a volunteer, I, you know, I, I'm the first to raise my hand, I'll go, because when you're experiencing pure, internal, eternal, absolute love, and you're on fire to learn because you're on fire to create, wherever love is, I am. So it's naturally to protect all sacred life. Remember, in other words, you could be a human being or a tree. I'm going to love a tree equally as much as I love you. So I'm going to protect a tree as much as I am a water bug. Right? Because if it's in my mirror, then it's in our shield. So the silver and gold mated one is the one I serve. So wherever the one wants me is wherever I'm going to be. That's an eternal sun, the eternal source of all electrical power, building capacitors. And so the, the system popped up in front of my face a little while ago, and, um, and I listened to some of the, the, the lady that opened up an argument, and so, you know, how they go back and forth, right? And talking about rationale, like in ratios, like in mathematical ratios, and the word logic gets thrown up, right? Um, and so the punchline was when she talked about, because one of the justices on the court talked about, he, he's trying to, to, to get a fix on, on what this lady's argument is, right? Because it's pretty obvious that she's an advocate for children. Now, I know somebody that knows a lot about this. And that's Tim Refat. You know who Tim Refat is? Vampire Services? MI6? MK Ultra Programs? Super Soldier Programs? What was known as uh, Colin Bloy? Miles Johnson at the Basis Project knows him. Tim Refat. And, and he was giving coursework on images of real people, right? And how those images and, and the argument that the lady was presenting when a child has been sexually tortured by a sexual energy vampire and then you circulate an image of a real being with a real soul, with a living spirit, all it takes is one real image. 
Now you have 275 million more that are being circulated through artificial intelligence. Do you have any idea what happens every time that the image of that real soul is being viewed by another sexual predatory vampire? over and over and over and over and over and over again, sucking life force energy out of that soul, that child, through artificial intelligence. Because it has no feelings. And it has no eternal born power to generate a brand new, pure seed star. That's why it was a cosmic level SWAT team. Because the sexual predator, molester, that has no feelings, is experiencing that child being tortured over and over and over and over again. Because it has no feelings. So the only way that it can experience any feelings It's through the torture and pain of another. That's why we're all here. That's the trap. That's the Borgia Matrix trap experiment. It's your fault, Neil. Remember when I talked about when I was a child? I've already forgiven it. I don't want to hold on to no electrons. Zero mass. Less is more. Right? We, it, it's, it's logical. I think it's logical. I know it's logical. As logos, as a log scale exponent, as the accelerator of electrical speed. why it's a good idea to let go of every electron to increase the electrical output so there is no time delay which is equally sharing that's an eternal sun equally sharing pure eternal absolute love to every living cell Every living spirit, every solar-coded encrypted unit of energy that is self-aware, that is experiencing the first state of awareness, which is the innocence of Adama and Amareya, which is pure as pure as pure can be, the source field of all there is, the permanent records, the first recorder, the eternal spirit, a pure fire, fire and ice, join as one, and why we're all here, experiencing being one with the first one, the eternal one, the one we serve, Muave.